Yo, well gone. Hope you're having a great day. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add a beat or an MP3 file or WAV file or a sample into FL Studio 20. Okay, so this is going to be perfect if you need to add a beat to record over or you want to bring in a sample to make a beat over and what have you. You, you know what you want to do in it. I'm just going to get into the video. If you don't know who I am, I'm Jay Carter Ray from jcarterray.com teaching you how to be better at music, online business business and online marketing this is the number one spot for musicians and creatives that don't want to be starving artists so if that sounds like you click on that subscribe button check out the rest of the content on the channel because you will love it here now let's get straight into it with a question of the day my question of the day is what are you trying to import into fl studio are you trying to import a beat so you can record over it you're trying to import a sample let me know now this is being made because of a question someone asked on one of my videos he asked me how do you add a beat to fl studio i thought like i wrongfully assumed that everyone knew how to add beats to fl studio that was just me going off my knowledge that i already have in it which we do a lot of the times when you have knowledge you assume everyone else has that same knowledge because you think what, don't you know this but this gentleman did not know this so this video is for him now it's very very easy and very very straightforward to do this i did believe that there was an addition of fl studio where you couldn't actually import mp3 files but doing a bit of research i couldn't actually find that that was the case so in order to import a mp3 file or wav file all you need to do is select it now this is our mp3 file and drag it in so i've dragged this beat all the way into fl studio and if we play this back it's in there and it's working and if we bring in the web version of this beat and just drag it in just drag it in very very nice and easy <laughs> this is called really cool. that's right it's working <laughs> very very simple very very easy all you need to do is drag it in from your folder now if of course if it's in a zip folder or what have you then you'll probably need to export that zip folder first and i do have a video on my channel on how to export zip files and how to extract zip files that sort of stuff so just check the channel search for that but that's it very very simple very very straightforward i don't want to waste your time however since you got to this part in the video i do want to give you a free gift i want to give you five of my best beats for absolutely free all you need to do is click on the link in the description or go to jcarterray.com forward slash free beats and the thing about these beats is they also come with five of my basic licenses which usually cost $29.95 on my beat store that means you get over a hundred dollars of free beats and that's not all you can also use these beats because you got that basic license to make money from your songs by uploading your song to Spotify Apple Music and other streaming platforms as well as you know the digital stores and all that sort of stuff if do people still sell music these days i don't know but you can upload it to there if you like and start making some money from your music so definitely click on that link in the description get your free beats today if you have any other questions or any other tutorials you want me to make please leave them in the comment section down below in the next video you'll learn about music online business and online marketing i'll see you there peace out